Hi you guys! Yesterday I talked about the angler fish that lives in the very deep parts of the ocean and it's a fish that has the light bulb on top of its head, kind of like a fishing pole that helps it um, catch its food and hunt for its food. So today I wanted to make a angler fish art with you guys. So what you'll need uh, is a plate, um, some paint or markers, or watercolor or crayons, whatever you want to color your angler fish with, um, some glue, and either a pipe cleaner to make the light bulb on top of the angler fish or um, some paper, construction paper that we can cut out. I'll show you both and how we can do both if you don't have one or the other. Um, so, and, and you'll need scissors. Um, so get your supplies and come do this art with me. Okay, so first thing you wanna do is um, you might need your parents to help you with this. You want to draw zigzag lines coming through the middle of your plate. So I'm going to show you that. And then these are going to be its teeth. So it's supposed to look like that. Can you guys see it? I put it too high. It's supposed to look like that. Um, and then we're going to follow those zigzag lines and we're going to cut them out. So, and here's the thing. If you want to keep your anglerfish together, don't cut it all the way through. But if you want to make your anglerfish open and close its mouth and cut it all the way through, and then I'll show you how to put it together where the mouth will open and close. But you'll need a hole punch for that. Um, so let me cut it out and I'll show you both. So follow those zigzag lines. You might need your parents to help you. Okay, so here's the anglerfish without it being cut out um, the whole way. But if you do want to make your anglerfish open and close its mouth, then cut it into two pieces. And then if you want to put it together where it'll open and close, you can either get, um, you can hole punch it right here and make a little hole where you can use a pipe cleaner or a rubber band or string help put it together and then that way when it's together you can open and close its mouth so let me go get my hole puncher and i'll show you how to do that have your um, angler fish in one piece you can just skip this part but i'm going to show you how to put your angler fish together so i have my hole punch i want to make a hole on both of them it makes a hole and then i'm going to use a part of my pipe cleaner to put it together um, or you can use a rubber band or string or anything that would put keep your um, angler fish together. I'm gonna twist it. And then I'm gonna put it behind so it can hide the so that way it's together and then it can open and close its mouth. So when you have those pieces together, now is the fun part. You get to pick what color you want your anglerfish to be. You can make your anglerfish whatever color you want to be. I have uh, all my paint here. I'm going to put it on this plate and we are going to paint our anglerfish. Here is my paint. I put it on another plate and we are going to paint our fish. So you can either um, mix your glue with your anglerfish. I mean, sorry, with your paint, you can either mix your glue with your paint um, and that way when we put our eyes on and our light bulbs on, it'll just stick to the paint. Or you can do the like I'm doing and paint it first and then put our eyeballs on. It's uh, completely up to you. So if you have googly eyes, that would be awesome. I don't have any googly eyes, so I'm gonna cut it out of paper. I'm going to cut my eyes out of paper and I'm going to cut my light bulb out of paper. paint is wet and you have glue you can stick your eyeballs on and your um, 
light bulb on and then our angler fish would be finished. So I cut out a white circle and a black circle and this is gonna be its eyeball. So I'm gonna put, you can either do one or two but I'm doing it facing sideways. Put your white on and you might need a little bit of glue or paint um, for the black part. A little bit of glue, you stick that on and look, it's coming alive. Um, and here is the light bulb that I cut out of yellow construction paper. So you remember the angler fish, it, it's um, light bulb hangs from the top of its head to the front of its mouth. And the reason for that is because the angler fish um, uses this light bulb to lure fish to its mouth. So because it lights up in the very deep dark parts of the ocean, the fish swim towards this light bulb that hangs right over its mouth. And then as the fish is swimming to this light in the dark part of the ocean, he goes in and he's chomp and he chomps it and eats it. And that's how it gets his food. So I'm gonna glue my um, light bulb right there and then our angler fish would be finished. Put glue there and then I'm gonna let it dry.